Hi, I'm John Sage with Sage Traveling, and I'm here on the Carnival Breeze cruise ship, uh, which sails out of Miami, um, showing you the accessibility features of one of the disabled rooms here. Uh, this room is actually 11275. Uh, it's one of the smaller rooms, one of the smaller accessible rooms I I've been on, but it's also one of the cheaper, so that's definitely why they're able to, to uh, offer uh, cheaper rates. Uh, I'll, let me lead you on a, a little tour around the room. So here is the door to enter, which is wider than the normal doors. Um, that's a, a key feature of accessibility, of, of uh, accessible cabins on cruise ships. The closet here is one of the smaller closets that I've encountered on the cruise ships. There is the hangers hang about 10 garments over there, and there are, uh, you can see the shelves from the ceiling to the floor here to, to put other items. Um, You've got a small TV on the wall, um, a mini fridge uh, located at the foot of the bed. This is actually a single bed. Uh, there is another bed that comes out of the ceiling for basically sort of bunk beds. Um, and so a lot of people uh, won't, won't want this room for, for that reason. Um, I'm traveling by myself doing accessibility research, so it's not a, a huge deal, although I have been in other uh, disabled rooms traveling alone where the, the bed was, was much small, uh, much larger. Um, there is a, a small nightstand here. The desk um, is about normal, uh, normal size compared to other, other accessible rooms that I've been in. Moving into the bathroom, the bathroom door is wider and it has a roll-in shower uh, just like every disabled bathroom um, on a cruise ship that, I, that I've been in. Uh, the roll-in shower here with the, the padded seat uh, the handheld shower nozzle, the toilet extends sort of diagonally out from the wall so there's not uh, grab bars directly next to it. Um, some people might have an issue with this. I, I haven't at all. It's really worked out fine. And the, uh, the, the sink is raised and so my uh, knees in, in my wheelchair can roll underneath that. Uh, the other issue with this cabin actually doesn't have to do with anything inside the cabin. It's that the the nearest entrance to get out to the common areas near the pool, there are three steps. So this is not a cabin that I would recommend um, for uh, for our clients, for for disabled travelers. Uh, but I am going to check out some other cabins and and we'll uh, evaluate those. And I imagine those are going to be uh, better options for disabled cruisers. Uh, my full accessibility report on the, the Carnival Breeze will be posted on the website AccessibleCaribbeanVacations.com. Uh, go there for a, a lot more accessibility information uh, about this ship and the, the ports that it visits.